As the mayor of Lamarck prepares to face a recall election in November, the man behind the push is starting an effort to remove another city leader from office as well. It is an update to a story KPRC2 first brought you earlier this month. Mayor Keith Bell was elected last year. The man who organized the recall petition against Bell is now working on another recall effort. KPRC2's Robert Arnold joins us now from Lamarck to break down the newest petition. Robert. Lamarck resident Joseph Lowry is still working to get the signatures needed for this particular recall. He's already led successful efforts to roll back the city's tax rate and, as you mentioned, force the mayor into a recall election this November. This time, Lowry wants council member Kimberly Yancey recalled, even though she hasn't made it through her first term in office yet. Division in the community since her election, I've, I've never seen that in, in my entire life, a, a community be so divided. Joseph Lowry accuses Councilmember Kimberly Yancey of using race to divide the Lamarck community. And uses uh, a lot of racial, uh, it's almost like a, a prison tactic, a, a prison politics to uh, divide the community. That is absolutely not true. Councilmember Yancey is firing back, saying she respects Lowry's right to seek a recall of an elected official, but. Our election was a true election. The people spoke, and we need to respect that. Recall efforts should not be a form of harassment. What did not happen on January 6th, do it in your local government. And that's what's happening with this instance. The council member did point out at least one resident was falsely told the petition they were signing was to keep her in office when the opposite is true. We asked Lowry about that, and he blamed it on a person he had not met who was working on the recall effort. I got wind of it yesterday, and they had terminated the employee. Um, he, he was terminated, and they threw out 100 signatures that he had collected just to be uh, safe. To trigger a recall, 51% of the number of people who voted in the last election have to sign this petition. We will keep you posted on whether that happens. Meanwhile, the mayor is facing his recall election November 8th. Reporting live from the city of Lamarck, Robert Arnold, KPRC 2 News.